everyone today I have my summer favorites I know I can't believe summer's almost over and I know I've been gone for a while and I'm so sorry I've been working all summer and um, this coming week is finals I took 15 credits this summer so I've been busy with that too but I have products here in front of me that I've been loving all summer that I really want to kind of share with you guys as kind of like a little catch-up um, so I'm just gonna jump in I'm gonna start with makeup then skincare then like other things so here's the first one it's the Laura Geller balance and brighten powder foundation this is basically what I've worn every single day it's what I'm wearing right now. I really love it. I don't really wear like a primer underneath or any sort of like liquid, um, you know, product like a CC cream or foundation underneath. I just wear this. So this is what it looks like. It's just like a um, baked marbleized powder. Like I said, mine's in the shade medium and every one you're going to get, you know, each of them are going to be different. So, you know, you could have a medium that's a lot darker than this. You could have a medium that's a lot lighter than this. You just have to kind of, t you know, take and choose and whatever but anyway I love this I think it's a great powder foundation like I said it's what I'm wearing today I get a lot of freckles in the summer and I like them so I don't want to cover them up and I find that a lot of liquid um oh my god my dog is going insane outside a lot of liquid products just kind of like look like they're sitting on top of my skin and I don't know they just don't really work well with me in the summer so I like a powder foundation for mascara, I wear waterproof mascara all summer long. Um, this one has been my favorite. It's from Essence. so only a couple bucks. It's called the Get Big Lashes Volume Boost Waterproof. So um, this is what it looks like. It's just a you know, natural bristle brush here. It's kind of large, but not too big. I really like it. I just kind of you know do the zigzag thing and pull it through. I do about two coats every day, and that's all I need. It does stay all day. You know, my lashes stay up, um, and it doesn't go anywhere. So I really love this mascara. It is, I mean, it's waterproof, so it does take a little bit of time to get off at night, but I really love it. So for concealer, I don't really wear much concealer on the daily, um, but I obviously wear my sunglasses, so I have kind of like reverse raccoon, you know, sunglass tan line. Um, and so this has been the product that I use underneath my eyes to kind of like, you know, even it out. It's the Bare Mineral Stroke of Light Eye Brightener, and I have mine in this shade, oh, Luminous. Um, I really like it. I I don't know. I've had it and I just kind of like put it off to the side. I really like it. I think it's great for brightening and for kind of evening things out. I think this is going to be great even when my tan does fade for me. So I just have been really loving this for underneath my eyes when I am like going out. Um, if I'm going out to dinner or, you know, just have to look nice for work or something, um, which isn't very often. But if I have to look nice, this is what I'm using under my eyes to kind of counteract the tan line I have going on. So to make all my makeup stay, I discovered this this summer, it is the Urban Decay D Slick um, Makeup Setting Spray. I am a huge fan of the All Nighter, but a bigger fan of the D Slick. Um, I have combo oily skin in the summer for sure, and this has been like a lifesaver. It really just, you know, helps everything stay in place without getting too shiny or anything like that. I'm almost out of this. This is the travel size, so I think I am going to pick up the full size of this for the rest of August and going into September and stuff um, because it still is pretty warm in September where I live anyway, so I love this. Um, moving on to skincare, there have been two um, main skincare products that anytime I start to break out, like I sweat a lot. I mean, now the chlorine, you know, like my skin puts up with a lot in the summer, a ton of sunscreen. I feel like I get little texture bumps a lot, and these two products have really cleared that up. So this is the serum. I've talked about it before. Um, it's the Mira T-Zone Refine, T-Zone Pore Refining Serum. Um, and before I was just using this just in my T-Zone, but now I use it all over my face, and it really helps clear up those little bumps. Love it. Highly recommend it. Um, definitely a staple for me now. Like now that I've started to use it, I can't go without it. You know, I can tell a huge difference. And this is the Andalou Naturals Beta Hydroxy Complex Recovery Cream. Um, it's from the Clarifying line. This is just a little sample. Um, it's a night cream. I forgot to mention that. But I did buy the full size. I just um, haven't, you know, opened it up yet. But I really love this. It's got um, salicylic acid in it. It just sits really well on the skin at night. And I feel like these two together just are magic. They just clear everything up um, for the most part, really minimize it. I mean, it'll still take a couple days for things to completely go away, but it does help. So I really love this product and I'm definitely a huge fan and definitely will keep using it. And then I have another kind of face product that I've discovered this summer. It's the Alba Botanica Acne Dote. This is the Maximum Strength Face and Body Scrub um, with 2% salicylic acne um, treatment, you know, acid, not acne, acid. Um, there's no parabens, phthalates, or synthetic fragrance, 100% vegetarian, cruelty-free. 
it's just an awesome product. This is huge. This is eight ounces. I keep this in my shower. So when I shower, I use this to wash my face. Um, I can show you a little bit of the consist consistency. Um, so it's just this brown color. And hopefully you're going to be able to tell, but here, I'll put some on my hand. It's a very fine um, texture. It's not very harsh at all. And, you know, it just rubs in. You can push hard if you want a harder scrub. Or, you know, you can be very gentle and just let it glide across your face. I also use it on my chest and, like, on my shoulders and right behind my neck. Because sometimes with my hair down, I can break out there. So I really like this. Um, just kind of in the shower to use on my face and just kind of go everywhere. It's awesome. So I definitely would think that you should check it out if you haven't already. I definitely want to check out more products from this line because I'm really impressed with it. Um, so now I'm going to go on to some other like beauty products. Uh, one is a sunscreen. I hauled this at the beginning of the summer and this is the Jason Sun Family Sunscreen. It's SPF 45, um, non-greasy, water resistant for 80 minutes. Um, I really like this. It is a really nice um, sunscreen. It doesn't irritate my skin at all. There is a fragrance to it. Um, it's kind of just like that beachy scent. If you've ever smelt the Hawaiian Tropic or whatever, it's kind of like that. Um, it does come out. It looks pretty thick. And that's something that always, every single time I use this, it like throws me off. It looks really thick. But it, when I, you know, blend it in, it goes really thin. So, um, I mean, you do have to rub it in, but it doesn't leave my you know, hands feeling sticky or anything. I don't feel too greasy. I mean, it is sunscreen, so you're always going to feel a little bit of grease, but not bad. Um, and I don't have a white cast. I mean, you can see where I put it, but I don't have a white cast. I really like it, and I definitely will always, you know, keep buying this because I really like the way it smells. I think that's nice. Um, and it works. I haven't really burnt much when I use this. I mean, sometimes I forget to use it and then I burn, but that's a different story. So I really like that. Um, another like body care product. I really like putting on body moisturizers, but in the summer, I feel like a lot of them are too thick. Even just regular lotion is very thick. This is from the body shop. It is the body puree. This is the strawberry one. I also have the Satsuma one and it's a very thin, almost gel consistency and it works for my skin so well in the summer. I go through it pretty quick, but that's all right. Um, I use it after the shower and then I also put it on before bed. I just really like it. I think it's a great product. It's a lot thinner. I think in the winter I will make sure I use lotion and like a body butter. But for the summer and like maybe late spring, this is a really nice product. And I'm glad I've discovered it because I definitely will keep using it in the future. And then just a couple more things. This is for my hair. I have naturally curly hair. I mean, it's up on bun right now, but I have naturally curly hair. And so in the summer, I do like to wear it down just because it's kind of like, you know, beachy, go with the flow, whatever. Um, but it's, it's taken me a long time to find products that I actually like. So this is from Desert Essence. It's the Coconut Soft Curls Hair Cream. And it looks like this. And it is pretty thick and very sticky. So I don't use too much of it. Um, and I just run it through my hair when it's wet after I've already, you know, like detangled it. And after I already put some oil into the ends. Then I put this all over and I kind of scrunch it up. Um, I think I might do a video showing you guys. If you have naturally curly hair, it can be a big struggle. Um... And I, I mean, I can definitely show you my like curly hair routine if you like, um, but I really like this stuff. And then two more things. This is the last like product, I guess. This is an Old Spice deodorant. I've heard a lot of people talk about it. I sweat. I just sweat a lot. And I'm not trying to, you know, say this is the best for you or not. I think it's up in the air. I don't believe that antiperspirants are that bad, but you know what? If you do, please don't attack me because that's, you know, never fun. So this is the Old Spice Wolf Thorn Antiperspirant and Deodorant. Looks like this has got the blue stripe with these weird, like, wolf things, but it smells so good. Um, It just smells like pretty citrusy and it works. I, like, it keeps me odor free and it keeps me from I mean I still sweat but not as bad so I really like it I am going to stick with it if you don't feel comfortable using antiperspirant that's fine don't do it then but I feel comfortable and my last favorite is something that I bought myself early on in the summer is the polar watch so I got mine off of Amazon um, it's a heart rate monitor so this is the actual like monitor um, and it goes, you know, like on, around you underneath your bra strap and then you have the watch and it tracks your heart rate and it tells you how many calories you burned. Uh, it tells you, um, you know, what level you're in based on your heart rate. It tells you how your fitness level overall is going 
and it tells you how many calories of fat, like what percentage of those calories were from fat. And I just really like it. So um, I will, I'm so glad I bought this. I mean, I waited a long time. I knew I wanted one, but kind of waited and I'm glad I got mine off of Amazon. Mine was like pre-used and everything's fine. I mean, I looked for the best condition I could find pre-used, but I really like it highly recommend so those are all of my favorites thank you guys so much for watching i'm sorry i've been gone for so long um probably won't have like regular videos super soon but probably getting closer to that so anyway thank you guys for hanging in there i will catch you later and i hope you guys have a great rest of your summer and if you've tried any of things let me know what you think down below because i'd love to you know chat with you guys about any of these products so all right i'll see you guys later bye